All right, so even though the movers aren't 100% done yet, I'm gonna do my first and second floor video starting here in the kitchen. For this floor, this probably has seen the, again, the biggest transformation. Uh, we've replaced that front door. It was just a, a regular old front door with a much smaller uh, set of glass. And then in this corner here, there were corner cabinets, very strange, so we, we took those out. And then right up there in the middle of the ceiling was like a two foot by two foot uh, fluorescent light that flickered. It was horrible. And then over there where those other two lights are above the window was another smaller fluorescent light. So we put all these recess lights in. We put those hanging pendant lights in. Uh, we painted, by we I mean Don, uh, painted all these cabinets. And you can see the green paint matches the walls. Um, so we did under the counter lights here too. So those are the, the lights above the sink. And then we have the under the counter lights that, that look really nice at, at nighttime. I think the biggest, coolest change we did was I, in the previous video, I showed that roof line that goes from there to there. It used to go right across this. The screens are in the window now, so you don't get the greatest shot, but this is just such a spectacular view that we can see from here. And as soon as we cut that roof off, it just let in so much light. Uh, so mostly just painting here, um, really not a whole lot else. Uh, we patched the ceiling, which you can see has since cracked, but there was a big gap in there. Um, and then we just put in some, some extra switches to accommodate for these lights. There was a ceiling fan there that hung down rather low, so we, we took that out. Uh, there was the back porch, there's another video on that. Uh, nest thermostats, we have one upstairs and downstairs. Uh, the hallway didn't really do much, we just painted it yellow. I uh, don't remember what color it was, probably an off-white. The bathroom, uh, I think it was like a green color, it wasn't very appealing. Um, we replaced the light above it, there was a cabinet here, we took that out and replaced that. Uh, we put in the shower doors, um, and then a, a nice window treatment, but nothing else in here. That was our basement, which we're just so happy about the way that came out. Uh, this room in here, again, just some paint. Uh, and then Don and Monica uh, put this tree in the wall, from what I hear, will never come off. Um, but it's really kind of cool looking, so we've enjoyed it while, while we've been here. And then in this room, again, I think just some paint. Um, and then, yep, Dawn and her trees. Oh, there's some more over there. Uh, so she did some trees in here. Um, oh, and something else. When we when we looked at the house, there was this, there was this hideous pinkish, faded pink rug uh, that was down here. So all this hardwood was underneath it. Uh, so we ripped the rug out, and then we had a rug guy come in. So in that area, and then all in here. Um, we, we put in, or we rather we had the, the floor sanded. Uh, again, not much in here. The, the mantle is oak, so we decided to paint it black. There's this light green color in the walls here. Uh, and then we had a big purple couch where I'm standing now. So we painted a matching purple color on the other side. Um, this door here was Actually, I believe a solid wood door, which was horrible because uh, this room was just so dark because you can see the windows are rather small for a room as big as this is. Uh, so we replaced that with this full glass door. Uh, it really made a big difference. And that's it for our first floor.